I'll tell you now, Sarah's gonna have a fit. What's going on guys, welcome to today's vlog. It is Thursday the 11th of October and me and Sarah are just about to dip out to get something to eat. And then we got to nip over to the office. Guess what we're printing now? What? Pumpkins. We're gonna start printing some Disney pumpkins. Gonna do a what Cheshire Cat pumpkin yeah. today. No, to sell. We're gonna do some Cheshire Cat pumpkins today. Me. Yeah, I do. We're gonna do some Cheshire Cat pumpkins today. So I'll have the Cheshire Cat's face at the front, have the tail at the back. Should look pretty sick when they're finished. But we don't know how long it's going to take yet. I haven't been in, I haven't sliced up the uh, the models yet. But when we've done them, I'm sure that you'll be able to see them. So once, you're climbing up on the couch. Yeah. So once we've done that, we're going to nip over to B&M's. We're going to do a bit of Christmas shopping. Then later on this evening, we're going to nip over to Ben and Siobhan's. We're not going to stay there for a long time because Sarah's got a ton of editing to do. Um, and I also want to crack on with the website for <clears throat> Star Killer Props, which should be up and running this weekend. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Before we go to Ben and Siobhan's, obviously the kids are gonna come over from school. We're gonna check in with the kids, see what they're up to, because nobody see the kids for ages, so we thought we'd check in with the kids tonight. If they want to, if they don't, that's just life, unfortunately. You won't get to see the kids. But if they are up for it, the kids will be in tonight's vlog. In fact, I'm pretty sure the kids haven't told you for a couple of days that the school dinners are hanging and um, <laughs> they haven't had any school dinners. And they've not lost any teeth nope. because they've not been eating. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure Vanellope will be in some kind of a mood tonight because she's been in nursery, although she wanted to go to nursery early today yeah, she because, to go today. because she thought that Tamsin was in, but Tamsin's not in today. So we're thinking of swapping the days for when Tamsin's actually in. Tamsin's only in one day a week now. Maybe she's only in one day a week, like Sarah. But we are actually no looking for a full time school because there is a couple of schools around here that take them on full time from being four. So hopefully, because she's four this month, they might take her on full time. There's two schools I've been looking at, but one of them used to be like the best school around here, at, but now it's like it's had a few issues with like parents so one of the parents it was in the news one of the parents was uh they, they actually raided the school for him they had to get the kids out because he was like a, a drug dealer or something um i mean you know how bad is it when your kids are being dragged out of school from social services for their own safety they're just pretty damning so it's like they say you know what it doesn't matter where you are it doesn't matter where you live there's, there is crime and idiots around you all the time yeah you can't avoid it doesn't matter where you live i mean it, even if we move to america it's over there it's just it's probably rife over there yeah, in America. It just doesn't, it don't matter where you are, it's happening all over the show, yeah. innit? I just think it's pretty sad myself, but. So anyway, we're gonna nip and go get some breakfast, then we're gonna nip to the office, then we're gonna nip to B&M's. So it's a, it's a pretty full on day today. All right, we're at the office now, me and Sarah. <clears throat> she's relaxing, she's tired. She hates being in here. I hate being in here at times as well. So We've just had something to eat. We're now gonna head over to B&M's. I just needed to finish off in here, set a few of the printers up, get them printing. This one is now printing the pumpkin. Yeah, the pumpkin, as you can see, the aluminous or the neon um, orange is, is kicking in. All the others are printing. I'm doing a new print over here, which is an alien sidearm. I just thought, you know what, while the printers are free, we may as well get something brand new off so we can put it onto eBay. So that should be printed 
later on this evening so dad's gonna switch, switch it over to the other side and this one's about to print this is the one that was broken yesterday but this one's about to print they're all printing basically apart from one of them we're gonna leave this one here for dad's when he comes in so we're gonna head over to b&m's now pick up a few christmas things and then um i'm gonna have to go and get the kids so we're in b&m's now we've just done a bit of shopping food shopping we're just gonna do, go and do a bit of christmas shopping now me and sarah are in here we're gonna go look at some christmas stuff in a minute as i said we've got quite a bit of food shopping here They've also started doing freezer stuff as well, so we're going to go and check out what they're doing here. I'm guessing it's kind of like not very good, so we probably won't do any of the freezer shopping here. We'll go to Tesco's or Asda, but you never know. They might surprise us and there might be something half decent in here, but we'll find out in a minute. She's... What have you got now? Buying unicorn socks. Who are they for? Not telling you. Not telling you. Shh, it's a secret. I don't think the kids watch them anyway. I know Chloe's boyfriends watch the vlogs, so. Hi Josh, Peter, Sam, <laughs> Greg, Curtis. Terence, Curtis, you okay? Every week I say I'm not coming in here because I just spend an absolute fortune, although today I've actually spent a fortune and it's for a good enough reason, so it doesn't really matter. Um, it's probably a first. So I'm just gonna, well, Dave, I'm not gonna go home on my own, obviously. Dave's gonna take me home obviously he's got to go and get the kids from school and he's picking imaging up so there won't be enough room for me today unfortunately so. but we managed to get a few things out of the way for christmas and all so it's nearly penelope's birthday so we really need to start looking for her birthday presents because i haven't got an idea of what to get her she is absolutely everything and she wants a bike, we know what she wants a bike, but we really can't think of anything else to get her apart from a bike. So it's just so hard. And then we've got Christmas, like, maybe not straight after her birthday. So it's just really difficult to pick what we, what, yeah, I'm just getting here because my legs are actually aching. I'm so tired today. So it's so hard to just decide what to get her. Like, most of the stuff that she's pointed at or picked, I want to get her for Christmas, so I don't want to like go mad for a birthday. We usually have a limit on birthdays when they get like hundred pound, and then they get to pick whatever they want. But I think the bike that she wants is like seventy pounds, so it's like just finding a few other bits to cover the cost of what she's got left. But trying to make it look like she's got a few things because when you pay quite a lot for one item and then it feels like they've only actually got one thing for the birthday doesn't it yeah so and i hate that but i suppose that's just the way it is isn't it she wants a bike and if the bike's expensive then it's, i mean i know she don't really understand what birthday is yet or she knows what christmas is believe me she knows that santa's coming that's all i hear of morning is santa coming yet Oh, she knows who Father Christmas is. <laughs> Every morning now she asks me, is, it, is Santa coming today? Which I think is one of the best things about being a kid. If the magic's still there, yeah, it's she, amazing. She loves it. So I keep saying, not yet, nearly. And the other thing is, is the baby coming yet? And it's like, no, when Santa's been, the baby will come. So it's getting us to understand. The presents are more important than the baby. Yeah, it's it's hard with a baby in it because they don't understand time. Right. So it's like she'll ask for something and you say, Yeah, you can later and it's like, no, no. It's like if you're saying if you say in a minute, she Alf used to do the same thing. If you yeah. say later, it'd kick off, but if you say in a minute, it's alright. It's prepared they're prepared to wait. <laughs> yeah. Like her minute is can be later or she don't really care how long it is just yet as long as it's like as long as she knows she's gonna get it and in a minute seems to make her understand that it's gonna be soon so anyway we're just gonna head home and then I think Dave will check in with you when he picks the kids up from school because he will have the camera and I need to do a baby update tonight so I'm gonna get prepared for that so I'm bedroom out tidy up do a bit of editing and then when Dave comes back to the camera I can use it so anyway I will see you later on we got back now from school picking the kids up Vanellope's here with me now and yesterday we bought her or I bought her me and Sarah bought her it was um, like kinetic sand but it was the Disney princess version of kinetic sand but it was it was all dried up and it just it worked kinetic sand it was just sand normal sand so 
Today, I nipped out and I picked her this up, which is like a gourmet um, ice cream truck thing because she's into the ice creams. She's got the Melissa and Doug ice cream set and she absolutely adores that, so <laughs> thought we'd get it. So I'm going to check in with her now and see what she thinks of it. What do you think of your ice cream set? Do you like it? Do you want me to open it for you and build it? Yeah? It's Can I have it? Build. It's not built, you need to build it. Yeah. What have you done at school today first? Um, play. Um, did you attack the glitter? Or did you try and hide the slime from the the boss? Tamsin was in. We the one with the bike! Guess what she did? She um, took her to pot of slime in and the boss of the nursery, Caroline, said you need to hide it, you need to put it away, so she kept hiding it with Tamsin. When she went, she kept nudging her going, has she gone yet? Has she gone yet? So is she being a little rascal today? Yeah? Open. I'm going to open it for you now. Answer me questions first, woman. Should I open it? Have you been a rascal today? No. Have you been a rascal? <laughs> and then we've just had a delivery from one of the subscribers, so we're going to open that now. So as Dave said, we had this parcel delivered from one of our subscribers, Emma and the boy. So we're just going to open that now and let you see where it is. We're so excited to see what it is. So I'm gonna let Dave open it this time because I always open everything. So. So I'm gonna open it. I'm gonna open it with an open. Should we open it together? Mm -hmm. Do you want to pull that? Pull it. Yeah. Oops, should we get the letter out first? Yeah. It says, to Dave and Sarah, just a little something for the happy and exciting arrival of your beautiful baby girl from Emma and the boys. Oh. I'll tell you now, Sarah's going to have a fit. So, it's a sleep grow, but it's got a name on it. Oh, that's so cute. You're going to cry. <laughs> So this is the first named piece that she's got. So it says Aurora on it there. Oh, uh, how good is that? It's got a name on. Oh, I'm show it. <laughs> you show it. You can show it. Go on then, you show it. Show everybody. How beautiful is that? Right. Where's the name? There. It's oh. a baby Aurora's. That is amazing. Thank you, Emma and the boys. So Emma's actually been messaging me all week saying um, it's not really much but it's I amazing. hope you like it and it brought tears to me eyes. Daddy got me there. I need to go there. Compose yourself Sarah. Well Emma, it's amazing. I got me there. So, so much. I just got me there. It's got me there. So Aurora's first official named thing. I'm so happy with it. It's like, it's the best. Thank you so much. Look. Say thank you. Look, it's got me there. Oh yeah, and you've got an ice cream can, haven't you? Yeah, because you have to send ice cream. Mine. What you do in nursery today? Um, just play. Just play? Yeah. She don't do anything in nursery. <laughs> just play. And what you're doing, son? You're doing your spellings, aren't you? Yep. We went through all your spellings and you got them all right, didn't you? And I got some slime. Clever boy, aren't you? I got some more slime. Oh, yeah, more slime. More dreaded slime. More dreaded slime. It's a oh, let's show everybody. Okay, let me just do this for it. No, don't do it on the couch. Right. You know what? <laughs> Can. Still. And you've got a glittery one, haven't you? Right, say bye to the guys because we'll see them in a bit. We'll show them some of your stuff you've got. And you got some. Okay, bye. And that and Daddy's got me this again. By sheer coincidence. Can you make me an ice cream, please? Yes. Can I have chocolate with sprinkles? Come on then, you're not a very good ice cream lady if you're not making me ice cream straight away. Oh, look at that, 
I'm not looking at you, the camera is. Show everybody how you're making ice cream. Okay, now where do we make our rotation though? That's the question. Where do we make our rotation? That's the one right there. They need a step. They need a No. And strawberry sauce. Oh, is it chocolate sauce? It's down. gonna be a lot of chocolate that. Right chocolate ice cream with chocolate sauce and sprinkles. Have you made it now? Why are you acting shy? Thank you. Mmm, that was so delicious. Thank you so much. No, I'm gonna get fat if you eat anymore. Okay. Alright, so we're on our way over now to Salford to go and meet Ben, aka Captain Spanner. Captain Spanner YouTube Troller. Whatever you want to call him. I call him Ben. It's called Ben, so we're going to go over now and see Ben in Salford, I think he is. Yeah, he's in Salford. So we're going to dip over there now, see him and Siobhan. And um, me and Sarah haven't even had anything to eat yet, so I don't know what we're going to do. We might probably eat something on the way home or make something on, when we get home. I don't know. I'm, I'm going to work it out later. 82 kilometers later. All right, so I've arrived out at Captain Spanner's house <laughs> with his lovely family. And Sarah's with me, of course. And they've gov they've given us. I can't even get my words out because uh, I'm very shy. In fact, before I was in IKEA, and uh, there isn't any footage because there was too many people around, so I couldn't film anything. So um, <laughs> you'll have to excuse me if I if I become a little flush around the cheeks because I'm very embarrassed. But um, anyway, they've they've kindly given us a present for the baby. So we're going to unwrap that, and then we're going to. Um, this wow. guy's a massive YouTuber as well. What's your name? Tegan. Tegan is a huge YouTuber. <laughs> if, you haven't heard about, if you haven't heard about Tegan, where have you been? Seriously, where have you been all your life? <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna open this present now with Sarah, and then we'll check back in with uh, the kids and everybody else. So, don't need my I don't. I want to be on there. We'll have this. Oh, look how cute that is. Oh, look. Should we let you have a proper look? You got a light? You put your light on. And then the build. Put the big light on. It's a proper Mancunian yeah, thing. Yeah, big light on. Get the big light on. Oh. 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 Oh.
This <laughs> is it. Hi, Scarlett. Feeling. Bye. No. Right. <laughs> yeah. And and Scarlett. And Grandma. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. And Romy. Romy. Hello. See his eyes like that then. <laughs> He's got a big blue eyes. <laughs> Many tic tacs later. So this is Joe as well. She comments on the live. Hi guys. What's your what's she's screen Hi. name on there? John Smith. John Smith. Just guiding me double chin people. <laughs> there he is. The original Captain Spanner troll <laughs> the killer. Infamous. Yeah. Infamous, yes. There's Siobhan. And Ah, oh, you're on there. Hi, Ben. Got to be quick. You got to be quicker than me, Siobhan. <laughs> Should know by now. I don't even know why you're hiding in the meantime. Don't be my husband. Oh, good. Many hours later. So we're just about to leave Siobhan and Ben's house now. We've talked about babies all night. The men are just sat there thinking, "Oh my God, <laughs> these two could just talk their wife away." Yes. We really could, couldn't we? Mm -hmm. Don't be so shy. Yeah. Say oh. hi. Hi. <laughs> so, we're going to leave Captain's banner. See ya. <laughs> Check it out for now. <laughs> I don't think I've got a really deep voice. I know, she's got so proud, bless her. She's done so well to talk tonight, though. I've got no Not stopped. I know. Want to say goodnight to everybody? Goodnight. Do you want to say goodnight? Goodnight. Good night. Goodnight. Just wait. <laughs> so we'll check back in with you guys once we get back home now. Um, I need to get some food, I'm starving. <laughs> Later that same evening. Alright guys, we got back home now from Ben's and Siobhan's. We had a fantastic time there. What a lovely couple. What an amazing family. They're, uh, the kids are a credit. And, um, and a mum. I think her sister was there as well, if I remember. Um, she's quiet, she's a Harry Potter fan, but what an amazing family and it's always great to meet people as well that watch her and then become friends It was fantastic and then obviously me personally I've got to just thank Emma Farrelly from Ireland who sent us over the um, the sleep bag with Aurora's name on it That was just amazing when somebody takes the time to package you something up and send it to you because they watch you and They they appreciate everything that you do on these vlogs and they want to they want to send something for your baby or for you or for for the kids or anything. It's one of the it, it's the best feeling ever. It's amazing. So thank you very much. It was um, it was awesome. And as you've seen from Sarah's reaction, it was genuine and it was just unbelievable. It's really weird seeing a, a name on something because we normally get everything customed, but we haven't had anything customed yet. We will be doing soon, but just to see a name on there and everything, it just looked it just made it seem. You know real if you I know that sounds weird because she's already here but she's not here she's inside his belly but you know what I mean so it's getting late I'm gonna end the vlog it's been a fantastic day today it's been an awesome uh, vlog to put together I'm looking forward to editing it after this we didn't go live from Ben's because when we got there we were talking and then I was we were the phones were, were dying and then the kids were there and we said we're gonna go live from there next week anyway so uh, Leanne if you're watching um, it doesn't matter if you click the notification bell or not, it does nothing anyway. So, we'll definitely go live from there next week, I think. So, do not forget to smash the like button, subscribe if you're not already, make sure you click the notification bell, it literally does nothing. Make sure you leave us a comment and we will see you guys tomorrow because we do this every single day.